Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What type of crime is aggravated assault? Aggravated assault is a serious offense that involves specific elements that distinguish it from simpler forms of assault. It is characterized by the intent to cause serious bodily harm to another person or the actual infliction of such harm. In most jurisdictions, aggravated assault requires that the defendant attempt to cause, or actually cause, serious bodily injury to another person. This can include using a deadly weapon, such as a gun or a knife, or any other instrument that could potentially inflict serious or fatal injury. The use of a deadly weapon during an assault is a key factor that can elevate a simple assault charge to an aggravated assault. Even if the weapon does not actually cause any injury, the mere use of it can create a serious fear for the victim's safety and thus qualify as aggravated assault. Aggravated assault is often classified as a felony, which carries more severe penalties compared to simple assault, which is typically a misdemeanor. Felony charges for aggravated assault can result in significant prison time, heavy fines, and other long-term consequences such as the loss of certain rights and privileges. The severity of the injury to the victim is another crucial factor. Assaults that cause serious physical injury, permanent injury, disfigurement, or a risk of death are generally considered aggravated assaults. The specific definition of serious injury can vary by state, but it often includes injuries that have a substantial impact on the victim's health and well-being. In addition to the physical aspects, the mental state of the perpetrator can also play a role. If the offender acted with the intent to cause severe bodily harm or with reckless indifference to human life, the charge can be elevated to aggravated assault. Defenses to aggravated assault charges include self-defense, where the defendant must prove that they reasonably believe the use of force was necessary to protect themselves against imminent danger. Other defenses may include mistaken identity or the lack of capability to inflict great bodily injury. Penalties for aggravated assault. The penalties for aggravated assault vary by state, but generally include lengthy prison sentences, significant fines, and other penalties such as restitution, community service, and mandatory anger management classes. In some states, an aggravated assault conviction can also trigger additional consequences under laws like California's Three Strikes Law. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.